This is Pat Benatar with Precious Time, Neil Giraldo on guitar. CBT guitar lesson for Ed. No, Ed, we already did a CBT lesson on the solo, so this time we're doing all the rhythm. Okay, standard tuning for this. Really cool, man. <clears throat> so the beginning, you'll hear it four seconds in, ninth fret G, just a pre-bend release. That just means you're bending it a whole step to that note. Got distortion on that, but that's the only part. And then those breaks at the beginning, seven, eight, G and B. You'll go once, twice, once, and then move it over twice. So this is on the G and B. And that's all with the band. Another one. And then fourth and fifth fret, same strings. Section 1A, 16 seconds in. There's uh, two guitar tracks you'll hear running through. So this is one of them. And then section 1D uh, is I kind of sort of played behind this or in front of it, I should probably say. But second fret D, and it's a hold, it's a chord, it's an arpeggio. You're picking four notes, D, G, B, E. 7A, open G, 4D, open B and E together. That is 4A, third finger, 2D index, 4G pinky, 1, 2, 1. And then you start it over. 4. Neil's use of chords are really good. Him and uh, <clears throat> his name's going to slip my mind uh, from the police. Andy Summers, similar. And Alex Lyson. Okay, section 1B, 32 seconds in. I love these chords. Very percussive. 7, mute, 7, 8. That's A, D, G, B. Make sure the D is dead. should be muted. And you're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then palm mute, ninth fret, D, G, D. Now, I use my third finger as like a bar or a shift. And then I'm going to go back to that prior chord, strum, you'll strum it, pause, palm mute the open E twice, strum the chord twice, palm mute up top twice, strum the chord once, so you have, four mute, four five, A, D, G, B, it's the same chord shapes, this is what we're doing up here on seven, eight, just move it back here. And then that's four times. Let me do one more of them. And I was wondering if he's... Or... Which we used earlier. But similar chord, or same chord, really. Um, section 1C, a minute three in. This is the chorus. Open 2-2, two, two, A, D, and G. Strum... Um, F sharp minor bar, bar everything to, fourth fret A, third finger, fourth fret D, pinky, strum, rest, and then play the root note, and then strum the five underneath strings, and then open E, and then open E and B, right back to the A chord, right back to the F sharp minor, but this time strum everything except the high E, and then E, B, G, D. And it goes. And that's, uh, and there's two guitars going on there. One's like, uh, or it's either there or here. But this one just seemed to flow more with it. Open uh, D, second fret G, third fret B, you're ready to go. Do the two middle strings together. And then pick E, B, G, E, B, G, E. And then move up to 4, G, 5, B. And do the same idea, um, but start on the G string for the root. Then this part's really cool. That's 7, B, 6, G. That's a hold. Um, play that eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then keep everything there. P, 
pinky 9B pick, pull off the 7, down up on the 6G, and do that two times. So it's... So you have... And then... Oops. And then it goes back to this. But I think it cuts it off early. Uh, up here we go... G E B G E B E. And then everything else, there you have it. It's all repeats from a minute 25 on. And I mean a lot of them because it's, uh, what is it, close to a six minute song, I think. So basically, you're dealing with um, three primary rhythms. Um, you already have the solo, uh, and then I, but I did notate the rhythm per the solo, the backing rhythm, which is. Uh, at 243 it's section 1b eight times and then it does it again but it's the chorus you'll see when you have the tab so um all right dad let me know if there's anything else you want thanks appreciate you man